Helping at five, a call to action across the state on legislation that would help protect domestic violence survivors from armed abusers. Faith leaders, survivors, and family members are calling for the passage of a set of bills which would prevent people convicted of domestic violence crimes from owning a gun for eight years following their conviction. Organizers say that in the state of Michigan, domestic abusers kill 50 women and 20 children with a gun every year. State Representative Amos O'Neill is sponsoring the bill. He says the legislation is not intended to impede on anyone's rights. You know, just look around the country. You know, we're America, and we have some of the highest rates of, uh, of homicide and murder uh, due to uh, domestic violence. And so what can we do? We can make action to su support and protect our families, our communities, to make them safer. Two mothers who lost their daughters to domestic violence are also speaking out. Their hopeful recently passed laws will pave the way for more gun control legislation in hopes of saving vulnerable lives. Our daughters didn't die in vain. I do feel um, that there is a shift, um, especially with the red flag. Um, it'll help a lot of women and men who are dealing with um, different situations that would possibly occur. Call for action rallies were also held today in Lansing, Royal Oak, Kalamazoo, Grand Rapids and Detroit.